Hey guys, what's going on? Joe Mills here for you. Today, I'm bringing you a fertilization and weed control episode of Cane Landscapes. Let's get into it. So, this is the truck. That's Nick. Nick has been a great teacher so far. Uh, there's only so much he can teach me, but uh, what he has taught me, it's been great. I really appreciate all his help. So right now, Nick is spraying a thing uh, in his backpack sprayer. The chemical is called Solitaire, which is a selective herbicide that will kill clover and uh, common broadleaf uh, weeds very powerfully. Um, so basically what we've been doing this week is uh, Nick has been spot spraying as per usual, getting the clover and all the other weeds, such as uh, red thread and lawns and uh, stuff like that, which I believe is a fungal disease. And um, I've been doing all the granular spreading for the most part, uh, using this Lesco spreader right here. It's actually pretty nice for a push spreader. I actually kind of like it. Um, and I'm going to show you guys right now what I've been spreading with it. So this is an empty bag of it, but it's Lebanon Pro, it's the brand, it's a fertilizer. It's a Lectus with uh, .225 insecticide. Uh, if you, you guys don't know what these three numbers are, it stands for NPK, which is nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. So you can see it has 8% total nitrogen, and 0% uh, phosphorus, and 0% potassium. Nitrogen and potassium often are the most, I'm trying to find the right way to say this, but limiting nutrients in nature, uh, most commonly the ones you have to replenish. So that's why most uh, fertilizer has uh, the three numbers on the bag, the NPK. Uh, nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium does different things. The best way to figure out what the right way to do, the right way, the right thing to do with your grass is to take a soil test and send it to your local cooperative extension. They will send back a report telling you what your soil needs and the best way to do it.
And there it is, all good to go. On to the next.